Today we're going to walk you through how the flash frame effect work on video with Ace Movie. Welcome back to Ace Movie channel. Here we'll teach you the latest editing tips. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe our channel and ring the bell so you never miss a video. Go ahead and comment down below that more tutorials you'd like to see from us. If you don't have Ace Movie, you can find the link to download it in the description below. If you don't want to go out to shoot the video, there are so many free video on this website, you can download the video you want to edit. Next, I'll show you how to make the flash frame effect in video with the following four steps. The first step, add your video onto the editing timeline and make sure you click the correct settings for your project. The second step, add black sticker to timeline. We're going to do is drop a black color solid layer on top of another track. Let's go to the left side of the screen. Click the elements tab. In the background, you can see there are several different color sticker. Here I'll choose a black sticker and add it to the timeline. A black sticker is just like a white sticker, except it's a different color. You can choose a black sticker or you can choose a color sticker. The color sticker could be any color. So go to the spot here. Let's zoom in. You can zoom the timeline by dragging this line, or you can drag here. The third step, adjust the duration of black sticker. Now you need to cut the black sticker short. You can also right click the black and change the duration of the sticker. Here, 0.05 second is the great choice. Let's preview it. It looks great. Because it's so quick to frame, that's the flash frame effect we want. You can change the duration you like, but be remember don't make it too long. If I make this frame too long, now you see, it's a just big black screen and it makes no sense. The suitable duration I think is 0.05 second minus 0.07 second. Maybe you think the 0.08 second is okay. It looks well when it have only one frames. But, if you use several frames, you will know the 0.08 second doesn't make sense, it still looks it's just several big black screens on it. So just use the 0.05 second minus 0.07 second. Let's go to the fourth step, duplicate the black sticker. After choosing the appropriate duration, copy around 4 or 5, and put them at a suitable distance not too long or too short. After that, click the play to preview it. The overall effect is not bad, but the flash frame effect is too blunt, so we can reduce the opacity of all black stickers to make the transition of the flash frame effect more natural. Here, I'll change the opacity to about 80%. This parameter is not fixed, just adjust it according to your preferences. Let's preview the final effect, this flash frame looks great. If you happy with the final effect, just go to the right corner, there is a little yellow button, click it to export your video. That's it for today's video tutorial. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for the new videos on the channel. Let us know what tutorials you'd like to see next in the comments below. Thanks for watching, see you next time. Yeah.